Tunisia's Paralympic team remains one of the best national teams in Africa and the world. Dozens of athletes have qualified for the 2021 Tokyo Paralympics. Despite the pandemic, gold medalists and record holders are training hard under the supervision of their technical staff and the Tunisian Paralympic Committee. Once again, CGTN's Adnan Shawashi has more. Paralympic and world champion Rawa Atlili claimed two victories in the first Grand Prix in the city of Cesolo. The international event took place from April 16th to 18th in Italy. Rawa won the women's discus throw a 40-46 with another gold in the women's shot put a 40-41-46 with a throw of 9.79 meters. Tokyo 2021 will be her fourth participation in the Olympics. I'm glad to take part in international tournaments amid the pandemic. Competition is important so that I can evaluate my physical and mental performance. I see this period as an opportunity to better prepare for the Paralympic Games in Tokyo. I'm very confident after the two gold medals. The technical director of the Tunisian Paralympic Federation says several para-athletics Grand Prix events have been confirmed in many countries. Tunisian athletes are taking part in World Para-Athletics Championships in the next few months to guarantee qualifications for the Summer Olympics. The national team is ready for the challenge. Tunisia hosted the Tunis 2021 World Para-Athletics Grand Prix in March. It's Africa's largest para-sport competition. Tunisian world record holder Walid Ktila won two gold medals in the men's 100m T34, 51-52, and the men's 800m T34, 54. The two gold medals in their 100m and 800m are confirmation of my qualification to the Olympics and the domination over the discipline. Finally, the pandemic gave me the chance to learn more and improve my performance in order to beat my own records in the Tokyo Olympics. The coronavirus pandemic forced the postponement of the 2021 World Para-Athletics Championships in Kobe, Japan, which now will be held in 2022. Tunisian athletes will be present at all Grand Prix events this year to hone their preparations for the rescheduled Paralympic Games in Tokyo. People here are hopeful that the global health crisis subsides to allow more competitions to be staged this year. Adnan Shawishi, CGTN, Tunis.